Hello and welcome to another episode of Talk of Scotland, a world tour of Fife. And today I'm joined by Peter Whiteford. Hello, Stuart. Scott Rose. Hi, Stuart. And Donald Mackay. Good morning, Stuart. <laughs> I don't know why I went posh. <laughs> uh, but anyway, yes, um, our world tour, we've played uh, five courses so far um, and this is our sixth. Well yeah. done. Yeah. Your counting's getting <laughs> better, Stuart. <laughs> <laughs> Last time out we played uh, Dunnakeer Park and I think Scott and Donald won that one. Six, yeah. six and five, yeah. emphatically. Yeah, emphatically, yeah. yeah. That was good. And <laughs> <laughs> and this time we decided, due to the <laughs> price of petrol, you know, the price of petrol's gone through the roof. It has. My, my pickup, because I've got a pickup, because I'm a farmer, uh, now costs 120 quid to fill, you know that? Yeah, it's mental, isn't wow. it? Absolutely mental. Is that why we stayed local, yeah? We stayed local. So we stayed local due to that, and we stayed in Kirkcaldy, and now we've gone to Kirkcaldy Golf Club. Our budget does not allow us to go further. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a lot of people know it as Bowery. <laughs> yes. Bowery Golf Club. Yes, the locals call it Bowery. What's, what's your thoughts on Bowery, Peter? You haven't, you've played there a lot over yeah, the years. Yeah, look, I played there um, loads of times uh, growing up as a kid. Um, and also, I, I, I actually go down there. I've got a lot of friends that play down there. So I go down there quite a few times every year. Um, and I still think the stretch from round about five to nine is uh, is brilliant for match play. I'd be a little bit scared with a card in my hand. But um, there's risk and reward, um, interesting holes. Um, it's not just driver thrash it's, you know you got to plot your way around those holes I think it's um, it's an interesting track and it's you know people like you said people always remember the walk up the first and like oh but we do got to walk up that mountain but it's that's it I want you to up there it's perfect so I, I actually think it's an underrated golf course again the golf course the day we played it was in great condition wasn't it it was it seems to be a theme I think obviously you know the greenkeepers know we're coming because uh, you know <clears throat> the big celebs big celebs coming yeah <laughs> uh, the greens were brilliant the course itself was brilliant we could have got it on a slightly warmer day uh, yeah we should, we should have went in the summer really yeah, rather than a, June yeah exactly yeah. <laughs> but no it was in fantastic condition and you know the club were very welcoming we were we were uh, treated like celebrities weren't we Peter well we even we had were. we had a, we even had a chauffeur going round with us Donald. Yeah, well, we had a greeter on the first tee uh-huh. right, the chauffeur a, a local member and Andrew Wood uh, or Andy Wood uh, and provided with tea and coffees on the way around yeah we got a cup of, like a proper cup of coffee on the sixth tea yeah. <laughs> well, and biscuits and then we were treated to rolls by the by yeah. the club out in the course and juice it was it's the best welcome I've had so far it is it, it is, is yeah Andy was Andy was brilliant he was uh, you know he greeted and did all the pictures in the first and then he, um, and he hung around for the whole round yeah so he, he, he did he did appear he will, he will appear in the video a couple of times <laughs> he, was, he was quite close by at times yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Commenta- commentary of his ball of him saying your ball's heading towards the trees a few times but it was interesting yeah. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not sure Andy knew we were filming a video <laughs> <laughs> to be honest <laughs> unless he just wanted to be part of the video he probably just he, c- he certainly will be part the video, I think you. Will, I think we'll yeah. see him a couple of times in the next yeah, few months. So if you see a sort of scruffy-looking gentleman, you know, hanging about at yeah. the back, that's Andy. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but yeah, not a long golf course. Um, and you see it like good for match play. Donald, me and you go there, right? Oh, so the teams this time were myself and Donald against the two youngsters. The youngins. The youngins. Yeah. I've been called that for a long time. <laughs> But, you know, we go there thinking, short golf course, Donald, this is right up our alley. Yeah, we got a chance, didn't we? We thought we had a chance. Yeah. But, but well, turned, yeah. Out, turned out it wasn't really... Well, we discovered. <laughs> it. However, Peter had a good day with the driver, to be fair. I mean, yeah. quite easily could have gone the other way. Yeah, he could. He could. And, Scott, and Scott was there too. Scott, and Scott, was, Scott was there too, yeah. <laughs> Scott was there too. <laughs> yeah. I thought we dovetailed beautifully, Scott. I thought we were great. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> A green fee at Kirkcaldy is between 70 and 25 pounds, which is very reasonable. Bargain. Um, yeah. And yeah, I think it's just a nice place to be. The place gives me the fear a little bit, I must admit. <laughs> well, the first tee shot gave you the fear. And well, I can't believe that first tee shot gives you the fear. Yeah, well, everything gives me I mean, sure, I get, I get the fear with the tee shots. But sorry, sorry to interrupt you. I don't think the fear's anything to do with golf or Stuart. Or <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, I was asked to do an after-dinner speech at Oh, that was. fear. Yeah, and when I walked in the clubhouse afterwards, I must admit, I needed the toilet. <laughs> I just feel Again. like I did it. It was my only ever time. I was asked to speak at a dinner and it was the worst. I still, to this day, is the worst experience of my life. You know? So I, what I, you thought you would do is start a podcast in a video series yeah. where you got to speak to <laughs> thousands of people. There was a boy, though. There was a guy that kept on giving me Peroni beers. 
in the clubhouse. It was the barman. Bar <laughs> 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 he kept on giving these beers, and I could, yeah, I don't know what I was talking about in the end. But anyway, it was, like most of the audience, <laughs> it wasn't good. So I apologise if any Kokodi members are watching that were there that night. Please uh, delete that from your memory and apologise. <laughs> okay, should we go into our game of golf? Yes, let's move on. So, Peter, as you mentioned, the first tee shot is like it's like the widest fairway in the in the world. I, I it's like hinted down the range. Well, the fairway sits across yourself, yeah. So it's like a hundred yards wide, and yet it gives me it does give me the fear. Yeah, I think as a junior, it was a <coughs> I always remember as a junior, it was one of those really hard tee shots. So you could just maybe get over the burn, but left was dead. But but you know that's as we're as not juniors now. As long you as you can, can carry it, kind of two hundred yards, you're all right. Yes, yeah, yeah. 400 yards wide if you can carry it 200 yards. <laughs> 400. There's I don't get the fear there. There's one teeny weeny little bunker, so. Behind <laughs> a big massive tree. But no one hits it in that bunker off the first. <laughs> We're needing you, Donald. Where did you go, Stuart? Right the hole, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's not good. Oh, no grab, Scott. Must have been a poor quality of strike. That's all right. Hey, Donald, I got the par. Nobody filmed it. I had a brilliant chip, didn't you, you I? You did, Stuart, you did. But you've got this for birdie. Freeze me up. <laughs> yeah. There's some shorts. They have good legs, Donald, actually. Donald. Did I tell you that I got the four? I got Listen, it. You just rushed me onto the tee, I didn't get a practice so the things look quick. I was actually quite happy with the strike. This is slippery. Well, one. Please. Oh, where'd it go? Oh, no. Oh, oh. Well, Scott, there's a bit of meat left in that bone. Yes, hang on. Oh, no. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. It was just, it was just a half and fours. It's a very, very hard green once you get up there. I mean, I wasn't that far off the green, but to get it close on that green is very. You always leave yourself a big, really, really skittery putt. Um, you always hear lots of stories of the members uh, having three or four putts in the first hole of the day. And yeah, you don't want to hit it above the hole at the first, especially no, when the greens it, get rapid. But yeah, yeah, so we got away with sort of a half and fours there, so it was, it was okay. Second hole, par three, probably, probably my least favourite hole in the course. I think. Yeah, it was playing. I think two fifteen. I think from memory. Pin yeah. was kind of left hand side, just obviously not far from that bunker. Yeah, it is. You had a lovely shot in there. Yeah, yeah I had a nice kind of four or five iron, I think, kind of pin high. Good Scott. Scotty. Well done, Scotty. Nice play, man. No, but it, it is, as you see, it's, a, it's not, not my favourite hole in the golf course. It's like it's typical long par three. Oh, he's done it. Oh. Right. But anyway, yes, I managed to snake a big long putt you for did. half. So you did, yeah. actually, yeah. And actually, when I see it on video, Peter's first reaction was like laughing at me because I think he thinks I pulled it. You definitely my... pulled it. I definitely pulled it. <laughs> yeah. Bogey. That was a bogey, was it? It's showing him the line, Stuart. It's showing him the line. Oh! Well, let's have a wee chat. Oh, oh, I think oh. it, I think it, yeah. Oh, I didn't scroll. Yeah, you missed it. Yes, I didn't miss it. It was his pish fat put me off. <laughs> it was. Then the fourth happened, the third happened, bef before the fourth. Yeah, that's normally how it happens, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So the third, but this was, this was the start of, you know, the short golf course should suit me and you, Donald, but not when they can drive the green. Yeah. Yes, very good. As Donald's hitting in there, Peter has just driven straight to the Tidy. Tidy. Very good. You're going to hold it to see my thumb, that's perfect. 
I'm all, I'm, I'm all about you stealing my thunder. <laughs> this is your best angle. <laughs> You've got a perfect big ass for golf. <laughs> Going low and spinny. Mm, not bad effort, Stuart. Sure. Take that one away. Thanks, stay up, Donald. Lovely putt, Scott. Please with that one. <laughs> Oh, bogey, bogey. You've got two. So yeah, that was an easy, easy win, really. Easy win, win, one up. Easy win. So, Scott, have you read this sign? Don't worry, I've got one. I've got one ready. Um, the fourth is uh, par four up the hill. Uh, wide, another very wide, but you can't miss the fairway, I don't think. Yeah, it's a generous fairway. It's a double fairway though, isn't it? It is a double fairway. Um, but nothing exciting happened at the hole, really. Beautiful. Good swing, Stuart. Oh, that... Gotta be pleased with that one, Stuart. I was delighted. Look at that. I did carry Donald's ball. It was brilliant. I mean, it went to <laughs> 30. <laughs> Oh. Yeah. Mm. I mean, nice. You struggle when you can't just drive the green, that's when you make your birdie say. Yeah, you feel, feel like power. <laughs> but shy. <laughs> but this camera angle doesn't quite show how shy that is. Let's go and have a look. Ooh, that's a better camera angle. Too low, straight. Oh, oh. Headlines, Pierre. Fine with them. Fine with them. Still Ridiculous. We're only one up. Uh, Fifth hole, par five. Tough tee shot, actually. Uh, well, tough tee shot if you decide to give it a little bit extra. I goal. hate it. I mean, like I said, I play there quite often. I reckon you love it, but you hate every it. Every. I'll only. Com I'll, I'll. I will not complete that hole four out of five times. <laughs> <laughs> Cause, and I only ever hit one shot. So a uh, stand up, it's elevated tee shot, it doesn't look good, there's w there's trouble left. No, it does look good. I've got it, uh, no, it does look good, but it doesn't look good in, to my eye. So it's an elevated tee shot with trouble on the left, and I know I've got to hit a driver to get the green, yes. and I can if I hit a good one. That's just, that just spells, just pick up your ball, Peter, because I'm going to hit it left in that bush. Yeah. Huh. I've never seen it hit so Get up on it. It's on the top level. You got the bridge. It is. Solid, Donald. A little tickle up the hill. Yep. Just two tickles, chip my pot. <laughs> yeah. Can I go for it? <laughs> Aye. Fine. Fine. Educated duff. <laughs> Did you say you have a horrible number? Left myself a horrible number, 55. So it happens when you um, go for the green, but hit, like, you take top. lasers from fifty-five. Yeah, I just, I, you know, just, I know, I know which. Uh, so, are you gonna show me your show me your forty-three-yard swing? My forty-three-yard swing is just. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> hey, come on, let's do this. That looks nice. Oh, when you say left, you mean like three inches left? Donald. Yes. How do you feel it's going so far? I mean, we're, we're one well, down. I think we're, we're doing well to be one down at the moment. But these are the tough holes for us. Yeah. You but know, you... And they're, they're bound to be a bit frustrated that they're only one up. Mm -hmm. And so. you stiffed it in there to about eight feet. Yeah, I'm, 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 stiffed I'm pretty it. good for that distance. Stiffed it, aye. Okay. That is my distance. Aye. Come on, break, 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 break. Yeah! <laughs> Quite smooth. Yeah! Oh, Donald Mackay. Six hole down the hill. Lovely wee hole. It is a nice wee hole. Yeah. yeah. 
Yeah, a lovely whole isn't it? Big hitters could have a go at it, but it's mega tight yeah. around about the green. Well, I took, driver. Dr- I took driver and uh, lost the left. Yeah. Yeah. Although it's me- it doesn't look from the tee that it's going to be mega tight, so that's what I mean by it's a tempter. You kind of think, oh, it looks wide enough down there. Mm. And, and But when you get down there, you realise you're only trying to fire driver onto that 15 yard fairway yeah. right? <laughs> from an elevation. But so it's then great, you, you hit iron down or rescue down, whatever you want to hit. Yeah. And leave a, a wedge in. You, you, well, it's a pretty simple iron off the tee, isn't yeah. it? You just For need to get people. it going. You, you just need to get it going. You need to hold yeah. on to your club. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, Stuart. Was that when we went, we had to go digging around for your three iron in the bushes behind the tee? <laughs> this might not be edited out. I was determined. Better not be edited out. I was determined going into this round of golf. Because people keep, people keep saying to me, oh, Stuart, you need to keep hold of your club. You know, you're a disgrace. <laughs> uh, and I was determined to. But that shot, I mean, that came fleeing at my hand, didn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Where on earth is that club? Sure, what happened? It's got, my club's gone it's lost, is it? <laughs> I hope it is. I can't believe we can't find it. Can I have a provision of it? It's gone, it's gone fairly oh, decent. I see it, I see it. Well done. Oh dear. Is it well done? done? Yeah, I am. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <identify> <laughs> 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 yes. We're done, Stuart. That's on Facebook Got later it. on. That's on Facebook. It was a way Pete found an iron in the trees and said, What are you playing? <laughs> <laughs> Is it a number three? Can you identify your club here? <laughs> Is it a Titleist three? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah As if the there's one. other clubs in there. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. And, I, and Andy Wood was in there helping me, and he was he was disappointed in my behaviour, and it was just an ugly situation. Embarrassing, actually, Stuart. It, it, actually, I wasn't embarrassed. Your kids embarrassed. should never ever watch you. But anyway, so, uh, but it did. I duffed it down the middle, and then we, we were all hit it onto the green. I was I was the closest. Uh, yeah, we all hit kind of poor wedges, really. Mm. You you got a big you got, you got a huge big skip forward. Uh, I landed it twenty yards short. Uh. Um, but yes, Peter rolled in one of his annoying putts. Yeah, hold a nice putt there. Yeah. It's nice. It's good. Yeah. Pretty poor wedge shot and then a nice putt. You only need one good shot at hole. It's so annoying. As you long know, as it's the last one. <laughs> I, f- I always feel like Peter, Peter's like, I, f- I, never, I never think he's a good putter. In my head, he's not a great putter. He, it's all right. But every time I play against him, he holds all the putts. It's annoying, eh? Yeah, I think he tends to look quite a good putter to me. <laughs> <laughs> look at this, Don. Look at this, Don. This is a hazard you've not seen before. It's, water a, out of it's a water out of bounds. That sounds dangerous, eh? You alright there, Don? Do you get a cup of yeah, coffee? Are you? Got a wee. Happy. Just a wee whiskey. <laughs> I really like the seventh. No, yeah, great wee party. It's a tiny green, isn't it? You forget how small it is until you get up there, you're like, oh, yeah. yeah. It's, ti- it's a tiny wee surface. It's a lovely wee hole. And they yeah, go- yeah, there's bailout. <clears throat> but it's, 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 again, it's a party. It's a lovely wee hole. We all yeah. love wee parties. Oh, that's ugly. <laughs> safe. Safe? It's 124 yards, you're playing safe. I couldn't mean to play safe. <laughs> That's in there. Water out of bounds! So they got a wee one there, they should have got one back. We should have, yeah. We really should have. Then there's the eighth. But yes, we all kind of hacked it on the green. No, oh, no, yeah. no. That's Peter, well. Peter has a second shot in the hazard. I yeah. didn't. Well, well technically it was. Looking a wee bit, is it in the bunker? Spin, spin right, spin right. Oh, oh, it's gone. It's in the hazard, Pete. It's not in the hazard, it's held on. How, how, how far did you have, Pete? Ah, it wasn't far done. Oh, about 80 yards? Yeah. Hit it in the hazard. Was it, yeah. There must have been a gust of wind or something. And then, <laughs> then he shanked his next I did one. not shank. This is what everyone says. I, it was sitting on a clover thing. It was over the place. A clover? Oh my god. <laughs> a clover. It was sitting on like a, 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 a weird weed. And it come out, come out at 45 degrees. <laughs> Was that a shank? What are you talking about? 
So you've been in the hazard and a shank in the one hole. Shank. No wonder you keep your score to fives. <laughs> Wait, I'm in a fire. Where's your bar? You still know in the sweet. It opened yeah. the club face, Donald. <laughs> okay. It was a so wee it was a wee shank. I mean I made four. A, Thank you. You did have to hold a putt again. <laughs> I shanked it to like four feet, unless not there's a spider crawling at your face as well. I like that. <laughs> <laughs> You're so scared of spiders. How big is it? Tiny. Is it what's this people? I'm unbelievably scared. It's pathetic. It's a tarantula, I'm not, that was that was like him on that tee. <laughs> <laughs> is it is it still there? No. No, no, you're all good. I don't like spiders. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, so yeah, I had a kind of a semi long putt to win the hole, but it was never going to go in. Yeah, so hole half and four. Yeah, hole, hole half and fours. Then on to the ninth. You guys were all flirting with the out of bounds. Yeah. Scott, you idiot. <laughs> <laughs> But again, this is why I love this golf course. It's one of those holes where, and again, I, I would play it differently with a card, I suppose, but it would probably be a two iron. But your driver gets you down, even in the wind that day, you can get down to sort of 50, 60 short of the green. And it's, and it's not a shoe in three, but you should be giving yourself a good chance at a three. And if you put a card in your hand, I'm not convinced I'll be hitting drivers there, and then all of a sudden you're going to be a full wedge to a small target. Down, down, down. It's a great shot. That's a good shot. It's okay, it's a wee bit long. It's a good putt. Start fucking hell. Yeah. Donald. Seriously, left right to you. Yeah, I don't know what happened there, Donald. Uh, but we managed to win that hole, didn't we, as well, Scott? Y you managed. I was just well, yeah. the support act on that hole. But yeah, well done. <laughs> yeah, but Donald had a chance at his putt, but yeah, that was... That wasn't the best putt again, was it? From about eight feet, <laughs> left about four feet short. I can't remember actually. No, I didn't. I just, just remember kind of not started being... a wee bit right <laughs> on it left or right. Yeah. It felt like one of those days. It felt like we were never going to hold the putt to get back in it. Was it? We were just kind of always. Right. Even when you had an eight foot, I just think, nah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> is that is that just that day, or is that not every day? <laughs> no. I mean, I sometimes Donald with his little jabby one can get quite good at that. I think. You know, you're you're not as bad as everybody. Says when you say everybody, you mean you three? <laughs> <laughs> I never used to think I was that bad until I started doing this. <laughs> right, let's move on to number ten. So you climb up the hill, um, which is actually where I realised how good a condition yes. the place was in. Actually, at beautifully that manicured. Yeah, the, the course just it wasn't. It's not just the greens and the fairways. Sometimes it's the little bits below the bushes. It's the, the surrounds and it's the strimmed bits, the little yeah. tidy bit. You wouldn't have liked it though, Donald, because these two were like hugging and you know skipping up the hill. You, you should have seen them. It was annoying. You know. <laughs> On the back nine, um, tenth hole, drive over par four down the hill. Everybody can drive it. Me and you, Donald, as well. Yep. Yeah, Unusually, not, ma not many par drivable fours. par three. Yep. <laughs> drivable par three. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, so these boys unfortunately were hitting irons, which is yeah. Just, but they didn't hit it on the green, Stuart. Yeah, uh -huh. but, but Donald, I was just short, and Donald was uh, Donald. Oh, so you didn't have Pete enough club. Gonna, yeah, so you Pete, used to hit wood. No, no, just it died on the slope, and Pete was kind of pin high right, just off the slope. So no, we didn't hit the green, but we could have. Look at this. This is uh, buggy uh, set for us. We've got breakfast. breakfast. Any bags? The champions. When I yes. am doing a Spoil. Oh, that's right. Diet Coke's a good thing. Thank you very much. Thanks, Andy, thank I'm you, another, another bit of your roll. You want to be juice or water? Oh, we've, we've had coffee already and shortbread. Oh, yeah, this is a good service. Eh? This is it. Just, just in case we're coming to your golf club. Are you watching? This is what we now expect. Although we are in Europe. Feel free to, to fill up that little bucket with maybe beers next <laughs> <laughs> Here's Donald. He's got to float this up. It's deceiving on the TV folks. He's to it high up onto the green. Oh, he's went with a... Oh, yeah. Well, it's a pup. I don't think he'll be chuffed. Stay up. Stay up. Stay up. Not bad. What's the chances of you not going up and down? Mm, three out of ten. Right, 
Oh, come on. <laughs> Cellophane bridge. Lucky done it. Oh, he's yipped it in. Ah, yipped it in. You can't be happy about that. So that was the tenth. Peter birdied. Ah, uh, yipped it in for the half. We're three down. It was important, yep, because if you went four. I mean, me and Scott kind of felt the game was over anyway because you mm -hmm. guys didn't have much fighting you really that day. But um, yeah, that was a big part, really. Not so good. I fucking hate golf. <laughs> <laughs> good try. Great effort. I don't know about you, Pete, but I was kind of struggling to get myself up for the back nine because it just thought. Yeah, it was a bit flat, wasn't it? Yeah, uh, just easy. not really giving us much to, to go with. Yeah. Very good. There's some fancy shoes. I just want to show them. Like them. Like a home lease. Look at these. Ooh. You've got to be a player to wear those. You do. Like. They're really fancy, Scott. Thanks very much. Oh dear. <laughs> that didn't look like Charlie Hoffman. Anyway. <laughs> mm. Oh! oh. Look at that. Look at that. There's a recoil. <laughs> yeah? That's good. good. Oh, it's just leaking a little bit right, Peter. Not quite what I pictured. No, no, you were in position here too. Here you go, here, Scott. I've got 119, Stuart. 119. What club are you going to play? One a wee knockdowny wedge. It's a wee bit of a. Uh, have you assessed your lie? Yeah, that's always the first thing I do. That's the first thing you do? Yeah. I have a feeling you're in between shots, maybe. See this? Yeah. Texas wedge. The Texas wedge? Yeah. <laughs> Do you know when you use this? Yeah. When you can chip. But your short game is on the best part, isn't it? Not today. Mm. Yeah. I just need a four to win the hole. Look at that, it's shank. Go on, run on. Run on. Good oh. beat. Uh oh. Uh, I think you would have got closer with the chip. Yes, I think I don't think, Maybe. I don't think I would have done. My, my bad chip would have been worse. Oh, yes. Hit it. So I missed the part, and that was us still three down after 12. The 13th is an interesting little par three up the hill. Mm. Yeah, not so little. Tricky. <laughs> Why is it? It's, it's so little that we were all short. Well, you maybe got it pin high last to go. In the bunker, but. Because yeah. you snap hooked it. What are you guys thinking, actually, here? Do you think there's any chance of you guys turning this around? At this moment in time? Yeah. No. No. <laughs> <laughs> no. We're not. Too, we're not. Only because we're not inspirational on the greens like you guys. Hold on. Picked up a caddy there, look. Never get it right. I've, I've played our millions, never get that hole right. Um, but partly it doesn't, you don't want a downhill putt, but it's not even that severe. I think in your back of your brain, you're like, oh, don't leave it above the hole, but it's not that severe. Yeah, but we weren't going to leave it above the hole where that pin was anyway. No, no so I've tried to putt it from off the front of the green through fringe, which is sticky. And I've, uh, <laughs> not, I didn't think it was that bad an effort, but um, I obviously didn't manage to make my three, but I'm left about four or five feet short thinking, my part I've got my partner, I've got Scott here. You know, he's got a putting studio. He's, oh. he's the man, he's got all your Capco, all, all the gadgets, he'll, he'll sort this out. Um, he's got yeah. the same putt as, I've had, as I just had, 
We're talking about going around a leaf. I'm like, oh, he's getting a bit exact here. This is perfect. Go. Hell. <laughs> Look at that! Still you only moved at 10 feet. <laughs> Still you, Scott. <laughs> Donald. <laughs> so anyway, but I, we we won that hole in a in a with a par, Donald. I felt at this stage that this is the only way we we're going to win holes, you know, if they muck up. You were right. You need to rig up your club, Stuart. Are you in a half, Stuart? Hi, Scott. Hi. I kind of feel like we're, we've, we've no real need to get to start playing well. Nah. It's quite, it's quite rubbish. difficult when you don't really need to get the second gear, isn't it? <laughs> to get yourself G'd up ready Playing rubbish. Go. Playing absolutely terribly, but we're these guys it. are, they threw a par at us in the last right enough. Yeah. Wasn't yeah. the most impressive, was it, for me, but... Yeah. But we're on the green, and they're God knows where. Exactly. Our bad shots go on the green, that, I think that's been the difference today. Uh, I don't know about that, but they're pretty rubbish. <laughs> Is this where you went and you were going to run and chip it? When you hit kind of a duff chip that you were going to try and hit your chip on the move? I didn't have a good chip. No, no I didn't have a good chip there. <laughs> but, you know... What <laughs> you yipped it. That was one of your bad yips. <laughs> yeah, it was good yips and bad yips, but you managed to... Um, Get it on the green the next one. Donald did a, um, an average chip. I, I did a pure chip. Pure yeah, pretty pure chip. I'm pure chips from just off the edge, but, but hold a nice putt. Correct. You did, Donald. You yeah. showed well, your balls there, Donald. That's you right, know, that's you, right. you had I tried to, to show them now and again. <laughs> 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 that's in a completely different social <laughs> site, though. <laughs> that's our other video series. <laughs> uh, but yeah, so you hold a putt for the half, which was fantastic because that meant. That we didn't lose the hole. Yeah, we're still two down, five to play. Losing well, another hole at this stage to play now. was uh, would would have been the end of us. Yep. Really. So we're still two down, four to play. Dry, I was going to say drive par four. It wasn't a drive par par four. It's three hundred twenty yards into the wind. Um, we all hit nice drives, and I was, I was gutted. <laughs> <laughs> we walked up, and then I got just about got to my ball, and I look up, and there's a ball sitting about ten feet from the hole, which was I, I felt like it was unfair. Donald. <laughs> Do you feel as though you were back at school and been bullied again? Yeah. It was, it was, I felt like I'd been cheated. Uh -huh. Yeah. No, no, that was an impressive t shirt. We've got to give him well done. due when it's due. I got uh, one away. Bounced out of the trees the whole before, and that one managed to stay straight. And, and, and yeah, it's um, it, it's on my limit to get there into the wind there. But they, it was it was good. And, um, you know, we, we, we discussed this before, but it was a little bit. I like that hole. I know, I know I've driven it on the green and whatever, and I kind of made it. A nothing hole but in general if I miss that another three yards left or, or five yards further right it's very very hard to make your three all of a sudden and you guys from where you're hitting it's 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 tricky enough as it is it's it's an elevated green I think I think it's a really well designed hole it gives you a chance but I tell you what if you go for it you better get it right or you're in, you're in a bit of trouble it's the kind of hole that uh, match play wise is a good hole and a stroke play gives me the fear you know the second shot narrow green do you know what I mean <laughs> I'm just saying, doesn't every golf hole give you the fear? <laughs> yeah, but uh, 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 playing match play, I've got no fear. Yeah. So, Have you guys ever thought about going to see a sports psychologist? <laughs> <laughs> I did actually once. I went to see somebody. He, he had me doing this tapping thing. I was like tapping my wrists and tapping pressure points in my body. And this was going to get rid of my fear. Yeah, I, and then they worked, did it? <laughs> I was like, what? I actually thought my friends were standing at the window watching me because I couldn't believe. He had me humming. I was like, hmm, oh. tapping. Like, what, what I think you're this? on the roof of Wall Street. Like, what, what is this? Um. My life, where's my life going? Mm -hmm. That was a wee bit magic. Got you, Got you, yeah. Scott Rose.
birdie here. Like that. Uh, good layup. So the 16th hole, I mean, Donald, we hit lovely drives here. I mean, just up yeah, middle. They had it, uh, yeah, down the left, just where left you have hand to side. Go. Yeah, exactly. That's where you should go, go to yeah. hit it. Yeah. Yeah. There's, there's a big clump of trees on the right. I mean, high trees. If you go anywhere near them, it's really death. Death. Yeah, you're dead. You're dead. <laughs> dead if you go. death. Dead. <laughs> you're, dead. you're dead. Scott hit it near the trees. I hit mine perfect. I yeah. had my spot. No, I had my spot <laughs> inside the trees. And I hit exactly where I wanted Nobody to. goes that close to the, the yeah. spot. Ah. Well, our, um, so you're two yards left of the big trunk. Perfect. Yeah. Had a great two line yards, in. Two yards right. with trouble. Two and yards right, you're out the hole. Andy had parked his buggy over there, and I thought, I'm going to need some advice for my next shot. I'm going to see what Andy thinks. <laughs> and I plunked it right next to him. Like a lump it, Andy was going to tell you something. Exactly. And Pete, <laughs> Pete hit it so far right that it was perfect. Yeah. Pete, I mean, Pete was off the planet right. Yeah. Off the planet right. And it was the perfect line into I wonder, that hole. I actually wonder if it's... Is it tight down there? Is it? Is it the way that some of the members will play the hole? No, no. We, could, no we could. surely uh, we, we can hit it far enough to be... All right. You have to hit it far enough to get trees. past those trees. And, and, and there was guys coming down the third hole by this stage, and I was embarrassed, very embarrassed to be over there hitting a the golf shot. <laughs> it's glorious. It's the right club. Stay up. Final Scott. It's time. It's time to shine, Donald. I would say there's a 99% chance it's going to be short. Sure. Oh, the this backswing will be about three inches. You'll try and accelerate. You just not really. No. Yep, there it is. <laughs> <laughs> Hold that, right? We're two down, right? We're two down with three to go. And mm. you've got a free putt. It's a three putt from 30 feet, though. Never Do once. A you... big swinging three putt. And, it, and I've got the line perfect. So I've got one out of two. It was the most disappointing. Right, moving on, moving on, right. We're half down four. That, yeah, it was, it was shy. This is a great hole. Although it's only a great hole if you get a tee shot away. And then if it's not a good tee shot, it's a really extremely boring oh. hole. Signature hole of the course, the one that everybody talks about, the 17th, very invite. I feel it's an unfair hole for us, Donald. You know, well, it was into the breeze. Yeah, we, we breeze, probably so can't get we were We were struggling. We would need a, a good tee shot, which none of us did. But if you hit it far enough, it goes down over the hill, and Peter was probably... What did you hit in there, Peter? I can't remember, about an eight-ish. He's hitting get down, but it looks okay. Yeah. Got a very hard bounce, it landed a bit short. That is a rubbish golf shot in there. Yeah. Hey Donna, we need a four. To, to probably lose. <laughs> oh dear. Go, go, great shot. Hold up. Uh, oh yeah, boys. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the happy campus. Cheers, buddy. Sorry. How does it, how does it feel, guys, to finally take over? Well, Scott's no. undefeated in Kirkcaldy. I'm, I'm undefeated in Kirkcaldy. That's Danny Keir and now uh, Balwini. You're like so. Phil Mickelson in Arizona. S see if they ever have an open championship in Kirkcaldy. The I'm Pip. Gonna, I'm gonna Pip's, uh, not Pip. What's it? Liv. Liv's coming in the phone for Scotty soon. <laughs> so that, that hands, was hands shaking there, was it? That was it. Do it we, was, yep. Is it three and one or two and one then? Three yeah, and it was three, three and one. one. Three and one. I think we've done quite well to hang on for that, to be honest. <laughs> too right. Too right, you did. <laughs> yeah, it, it, it seems to go down as another defeat for you, sure. It was a defeat for me as well, but. Well, just so as we, I'm, I've got the leaderboard here, right? <laughs> so we've played five courses. That was six, six now. Played six courses now. Peter, you're top of the leaderboard with four points. Donald has three points. Scott has three points, and I have two points. 
It's not that bad. I mean, I've lost the last three. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, anyway let, let's talk about the last hole. Though. I know, I know. The last we'll hole. get on to the last. Because I actually think the last hole, um, again, every, it depends what time of year you play, but the trees are growing in. It is almost a dog-leggy par three. It's getting tighter. Almost. Yeah. Um, and it's it, it's a cracking wee finishing hole, isn't it? They've, they've, they've redone the bunker at the front right, which Scott had a wee, wee shot at because he didn't really care because we'd already won. Obviously, that's why he went there. But um, yes, that's why. <laughs> it, I, it was yeah. more lucky to catch that bunker, wasn't it? <laughs> it it's a cracking wee hole. When was the last time you shanked it, Scott? <laughs> <laughs> you got wee. Eight. Well, it may, it's cars up there in the car park up in the left, so this right. ain't going left. Let's, let's see a wee finishing shank. That car's been through enough, hasn't it, Scott? <laughs> exactly, aye. Gears, uninsured drivers. <laughs> oh, that's... So bad. <laughs> that's like the fade draw. <laughs> Do you know what happened uh, though? Our pal Andy Wood. Yeah, he was. <laughs> our, our pal Andy Wood appeared, right? So I've hit a shot that looks like. I mean, there's a chance it's going to be a hole in one, right? I mean, I've hit a, a best shot of my day, just about. And it's landed just left and it's creeping across the hole. And, is it, and he's jumping in the video. With the, 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 the Everybody wants some five minutes of fame. Imagine, imagine if I got a home one and Andy's filling my divot <laughs> at my feet. <laughs> it was that for me was the moment of the day. It yeah, was, that was amazing, funny. amazing. Uh, I don't want to hit a seven because I don't like my seven. <laughs> <laughs> so good, Harry. But I need to hit it like a seven. Right, right just hit it. <laughs> <laughs> Oh! Oh, that's a bit tiggy. Oh, alright. Oh, look at that. That's an oh! That's done alright! It's out. It's done very well. <laughs> Scott, I, 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 you, got, you had to play a danger shot over my head at that hole. A well, I'm like, shot. there's a couple of people of a, of kind of coming to the club watching and I've hit a terrible, terrible iron shot in this bunker. I just want to get away and Stuart's like, I'll lie down and uh, go and hit it over my head. And I'm like, oh, for God's sake. So all I'd done was try to chunk it as much as I could so I went high enough over him. Yeah, you were... You, you were, did. You did. You were scared. I was a wee bit scared. You didn't say, oh, for God's sake, you went, oh, for God's sake. <laughs> yeah, that sounds, that sounds a wee bit more like me. <laughs> you were a fair. little bit... But you're actually like, it was impossible for you to actually hit him. But um, I know, but still, the fear's there when someone's out in front of you. I remember him doing it here in the driving range years ago. Obviously, he wouldn't do it now, but um, I was hitting drivers and he was lying down right in front of me. And he was taking camera pictures and I was like, oh, you're brave little, <laughs> brave little farmer boy. One. Nice, Donald. Oh. <laughs> Come on, Pete, take your time. Okay. Anyway, let's let's. Uh, can I can I ask you all who, what your favourite hole is? What's your favourite hole, Pierre? Uh, favourite hole, not favourite, favourite, favourite. The the the, 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 the par four is it eight? Uh, it's seven. Short. Six. Really short Six pass or eight. Four. Seven. The one that my, my wedge almost went out of bounds. Oh, it went that's into eight. the hazard. That's eight. Eight. Yeah, yeah. eight. <clears throat> so that's your favourite hole. Do you want to elaborate on that? Or is it just like... It just because it's, it's, it. It's, it's, it gives you options. If you're, if you're It just gives you massive... Uh, I still don't know. They keep changing it every year. If it's out of bounds or is it hazard or whatever. But um, either way, it gives you the heebie-jeebies off the tee. But I can get away with an iron. And then it's... And it's it, it used to be out of bounds on the bottom. It's now the hazard. Yeah. I think, it's, I think it's a cracking goal. If you hole. can just get it in play, it's a birdie hole. Yeah, because left dead as well. It's just one of those ones that it just, regardless, it gives you the fear. Scott? I'm going to go with five, the par five. I think, obviously, the elevated tee, it looks down. It's Visually, it's beautiful. And, like we said, you get a good drive away. If you're going to hit driver, you've got a chance of reaching. But even at that, you know, if you hit your three wood or whatever, you're going into the green, you hit left, it's dead. Mm -hmm. if you hit right, then you're not making the green. So I think it's you need two good shots to get out of that green. So yeah, I would go with five. That hole just gives me the fear, so I have to completely disagree. But yeah, that's fine. Okay, Donald, you're next. Uh, Michael six for similar reasons to what Pete said about eight. Uh, it invites a big hitter to to have a wee go, but it's mega tight. So if they actually do hit it on the green, they get great reward for it. But for your average golfer, they can hit iron or three wood down, wedge it on. It's actually quite an inviting shot. 
onto that green. So, yeah, so yeah. I like I like six, and or obviously seventeen would be the other one to say. But I was going to say like seventeen is probably the one that most people would say just because of the second yeah. shot down yeah. the hill. But when you're not, you've not got that second shot. Is nothing. Mm. My favourite one would be the eighteenth, uh, just because I yeah. think it's a cool. It's cool to finish a par three, and it's a nice middle iron par three. It looks good. It's in front of the clubhouse. Everybody's watching you. I just think it's a cool hole. Do you know the cool thing about this? It's the first time we've come away and asked this question and all said a different hole. Yeah. yeah. Normally there's a one hole that stands out, but at Kirkcaldy there are a number of little gems. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think, I think Kirkcaldy has grown on me over the years. Yeah. yeah. I think it, what ruins it for everybody is the first impression, the walk up the first. But after that, it's a lot of good holes. Yeah. It's good, it's good fun. But even the first that might not <coughs> be the, the best walk or visually the best, but it's a good test to start your round. Oh yeah, it's, so it's good in the putting green. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> certainly <laughs> test you in the putting green. That's for sure. Yeah. But no, I think you know, and we got it in great condition, uh, which always helps in a nice day. But yeah, I and thought, a, and, a, and a very welcoming club. They were, welcoming, and and yeah. and they they actually had a free bar for us, which we didn't realise until we'd already ordered coffees. <laughs> 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 so the next time. I'm, I'm going to be a bit more savvy about it. I did have a pint, Pete. I know you did. I know you did. But, you know, it was a bit early for us. Anyway, <laughs> I suppose I suppose that's enough gibber about Kokodi. Um, I don't know where we'll play next, but we'll decide that soon. Um, so go on to our... Well, you're already there, aren't you? Go on to our YouTube channel. <laughs> and watch, watch this. And watch this. <laughs> that's the worst but thing. But you have to sus- subscribe. Subscribe? Please. Please. Yeah, we want you to subscribe, and if you don't listen to our podcast, uh, and you've got nothing to do when you're driving the car, you should just listen to that as well. We're on, like, Apple, what are we on? We're Spotify, we're on oh, yeah. Apple Podcasts, all yeah. the major podcasting yeah. platforms. We're really famous, uh, so <laughs> you need to go on these things, subscribe, and listen to us, and watch this, and watch all the other videos we've done. Give us a thumbs up, and do all that stuff. Yeah, and if you want us to come to your golf course... Get, it's a goodie bag. Get in touch. <laughs> Goodie bag and a free bar, please. Yeah, goodie bag, free bar, and we'll be there. We'll be there. Yeah. All right, well, thank you, Peter. Thank you. And thank you, Scott. Thank you. Donald. Cheers, sir. And we'll see you all next time.